we basically committed to sitting down at the kitchen table, looking at our existing barrettes that we had, going to buy other barrettes. And at the, at the level and age of her comprehension, I'd say, well, this one works a little better than the other one. And I'd send her to school and if any, you know, any of them came back, <laughs> we said, okay, well, that one stayed a little better. Why did this one work versus the other one? And then we really just kind of reasoning. And, and, and like I said, at, at five years old, she was able to say, well, you know, mommy, these have these spiky things on them, like teeth. Maybe that's why they're staying in. So we just kind of make notes. Okay, so teeth are important. And even uh, looking back on experience, my mother had has always had a huge pet peeve. So if you, you understand or are familiar with classic barrettes, plastic barrettes, they usually just have one face, just one ornament, one design. So if it's at the end of a pigtail, it can twist or it can turn and you just see the back of it and you just see the strip. My mother hated that. <laughs> she hated that so much that if I, we were around her and Gabrielle's bows would turn and you would just see the back, she'd retwist it to be like, you gotta make sure you're still showing the design. And I was like, mom, that's like impossible. There's one side, like our hair is gonna flip and you're gonna see the back of it. So the one of the first things we said, okay, we're gonna come up with an idea because that's all we were trying to come up with was an idea to sell to an existing company. It's gotta have, you gotta be able to always see the design. So that's where the two faces came from. And then from there, it was like, how do we make it stay in the hair? So that the teeth, the craters, uh, the wraparound method with the center strip, all of that came from just sitting down and observing different barrettes that were on the market and, and coming up with a way that, to solve the problem of disappearing hair barrettes. 